So what we're doing here is laying down some uh, straw bales that we salvaged, actually, um, and being given away for free after being used as infrastructure at the Urbana Pride Fest foam party. Wow. <laughs> um, from Pride Fest to your garden. That's great. <laughs> uh, uh, putting down straw bales that we're then going to inoculate with wine cap stropharia and then put six to ten inches of compost right on top and plant directly into that and you get great uh, initial great raised bed vegetable growing and then as it decays the garden sinks into a lower mound garden and you just get tons of really rich soil organic matter um, forming the sort of base stratum of the garden and it's a, just a really fantastic easy way to establish a garden and improve soil and get uh, multiple crops by growing mushrooms and vegetables together. So do you expect, um, <laughs> like how many years can you expect to get a mushroom crop off this? Uh, there's, there's no data on that at all. I have no idea. Uh, what, I, what I expect, um, so speculatively, um, is that uh, with all this rich um, organic matter to decompose, the wine caps will just naturalize here. Mm -hmm. And that uh, you'll get crops for years, certainly. Okay. And um, if you continue to introduce mulch mm -hmm. and do surface mulching over time, then, and maybe like every four or five years, maybe like respawn and introduce some new genetic material, that you'll just, you know, be a perennial mushroom productive system. Great. And what do you think as far as crops? Do you think the same thing that you can just continue to get crops off it? Uh, vegetable crops? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I, it's definitely it's establishing a permanent a permanent vegetable bed. Wonderful. Thank you, Raptor. Yeah, no problem. <laughs>